One UI 8 beta program is now here and this is beta 1 running on my Galaxy S25 Ultra. The update size is around 3.4 GB and it has many new features. So let's see them one by one. First we are getting a new UI for quick share. I'll just swipe down on my Galaxy S25 and tap on quick share. You can see that now we have a new UI where I can send and receive files super easily. While my Galaxy S24 is running on One UI 7 and this is how quick share looks like here. It's a lot better on One UI 8. We have two separate tabs here. Next up, the file manager shows your downloaded files in a neat looking way. For example, if I tap on downloads, now it shows Chrome downloads and Samsung internet downloads in two separate tabs. Even if you use any other web browser for downloading files, it will show them right here. So it's super easy to find the right file that you downloaded from a specific web browser. Next we are getting the redesigned Samsung internet. So opening up Samsung internet. If I tap here, we have this new UI for the menu. While on Galaxy S24, we have that old menu for Samsung internet. And you can also customize this menu by long pressing on it. AI select is now a lot faster according to the change log. So let's check it out on both phones at the same time. Tapping on them. It's definitely a bit faster on Galaxy S25. When connected to Samsung DeX, now you can choose a bit higher resolution. And you can also rotate the display to 90, 180 and more angles. Split screen mode is now enhanced. When you have two apps opened up, you can push one app all the way to the corner. Like this. While this thing is not there with One UI 7 on Galaxy S24. Reminders app has been redesigned with categories shown at the top. I don't use Samsung Reminders app, but this update is looking kinda nice. So I might start using it again. Samsung has also added these sample reminders in this app. So some really nice features are added to this Reminders app in One UI 8. Next in Calendars app, you can add a reminder by tapping on this plus icon and tap on Reminder tab. So no need to open the Reminders app while this is not there on Galaxy S24. Camera app is now getting a new gesture for opening quick controls. Simply swipe up and down anywhere on the camera app to open this quick control panel like this. Weather app also got a redesign. Now it looks a bit more futuristic and cool with that blur effect. So these were some top features with One UI 8 Beta 1. I'll add some more screenshots of the change log so you can check them out. So what do you think about One UI 8 update? Let me know in the comment section and with that said, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, bye bye.